。所以，今天中国张大千先生在中国的画坛上，不仅仅有他的崇高的地位，而且在世界上也有他相当的地位。So I can say, and it's well recognized that Zhang Daqian not only achieved in the Chinese uh, art uh, field, but it's also well recognized in the international art world. At this point, I may just add a comment. And in, I think, uh, 1960s, the uh, New York Fine Arts, uh, International Fine Arts Association has recognized Zhang Daqian as the number one worldwide contemporary artist. So that's already been uh, recognized in the international art world, our world as well. So our friendship has started uh, uh, as early as in the 1950s. And in the 1960s and the early 70s, when we both were living in the, uh, California, uh, we have uh, uh, visited each other very often. And we both love uh, trees and flowers and plants. So one of our favorite time, besides talking about paintings, is to go visit the nurseries and uh, flower shops to find the unusual uh, uh, plants. Uh, there was a time when we were in Los Gatos, a Japanese artist's flower called Zulin Yuan. We found a flower, uh, a flower. 呃，张先生喜欢的不得了，呃，差不多呀，呃，这个盆景大概也有百八十年的老，很好一个梅树梅花。那么张先生要求这个，呃，这个主人呢，卖给他，主人说什么也不不肯。那么张先生很失望，回来就和我商量，他说我们怎么办呢？哎，他说我给他写个匾。说结果他就朱林元写这么一个匾呢，说第二天呢我们去和他换去。结果匾也写好了，第二天呢我把这个匾这个这个字也拿去了，朱林元几个字，这个主人呢还是不换。匾是收下了，哎，匾是收下了，但是我不卖。Um, I remember one time we visited a nursery in Los Gatos. It uh, was uh, owned and operated by a Japanese gentleman. And the name of the nursery is Bamboo Garden. And in there, uh, <coughs> Zhang Daqian has saw a bonsai that's of uh, a plum blossom. And he's very, very fond of it and really wants to buy it but the uh, owner uh, refused to sell it to him. So after they got home, Zhang Daqian had uh, discussed with Mr. Ho, says, how can I get him to sell me that bonsai, that plum blossom? So he says, hmm, maybe I will write a calligraphy for the name of the bamboo garden, and he can hang it there. And so the next day, they went with this calligraphy. And guess what? The owner still refused to sell him the plum blossom. But he says, I will keep the calligraphy, however. And he went back and said, I 结果就用他一张画，又去换去了。结果这个主人还是把画留下了，这个没还是没画。So they came home that night and they、uh, talked about it again, and、uh, Zhang Daqian refused to give up. So he thought, maybe, maybe I will paint a plum blossom. Maybe my painting, I can exchange it. So they went the day after, and guess what? The owner of that uh, bamboo garden, he's no fool. He says, this game is good. If I keep on doing this, I will get more and more of his paintings. 
So he kept the painting and refused to give him the plan. Uh, he went home, <laughs> so that night, uh, Zhang Da Qian thought about it. How can he own that bonsai? So he decided he will paint it. So he now painted the, the plum blossom in that bonsai. And he gave Mr. Ho that painting. He says, I tell you what. From now on, if when we thought about that plan, we can both look at the painting as if we saw the plan. So, so next time when you have a chance to see uh, Zhang Da Qian's painting of plum blossom, if you see the painting has an old trunk with just a few blossoms, that is the image of that bonsai. And you can see sort of imagine when he painted that plum blossom that he was thinking of that bonsai that he was not able to own. So from here, you can see the Zhang Xianzheng's character. He wants to do everything he wants to do. He wants to do everything he wants to do. So his character is in his character. This is a good example of Zhang's of uh, Zhang's uh, character. Uh, when he wants something, he's put his whole heart and soul to it. And this is why that he was able to reach the accomplishment in his art. Uh, he devotes his whole heart and soul to it. So, so you can see that every single stroke is distilled from his lifetime's study and thought and effort. Um, he puts his whole heart to it, and that's why he was able to achieve the, uh, the plateau of achievement that no other artist can uh, come close. He always is very sincere, and it's always very devoted, and he is not negligent of any single stroke, as it was exemplified in the film you just saw. Uh, now that concludes the reminiscence. Thank you.